guys. So I always get questions on my form string regarding discounted products, like discounted makeup products and where you can get them and stuff. And so I thought I would do an entire video talking about where I get all my discounted products so we can answer all of your questions. So one of the things I get asked about most is discounted polishes. And typically when I ask, when people ask me, they ask about OPI and China Glitz, which on, tend to run at like Sally's Beauty Supply or at local beauty supply stores from anywhere. Like China Glitz goes around six and um, OPI is going up to like nine. And let's be honest, if you're like into makeup and stuff, you collect it, right? I mean, I mean I'm mean, i a collector, it's what I do. So having like a lot of polishes that are $10 each, like honestly, that is way too much money. I could never spend $10 on a nail polish unless it was like thebomb.com. So there are many places that have been known to sell legitimate and real OPI and China Glitz at discontinued prices. And those are transdesign.com, 8 to 8 Beauty, and Head to Toe Beauty. So all of these links will be in the down bar so you can check them out. The only two places that I have personally ordered from were 8 to 8 Beauty and Transdesign. Both those websites have China Glaze, but only Transdesign has OPI. So if you want to order it that way. One of the little controversial things with 8 to 8 Beauty is it doesn't tell you the shipping cost until it's already been sent out. But this is the thing. You can always cancel your order and you'll get all your money refunded back if you find out the shipping's way too expensive to where you live. But personally, for me, I live in California. The shipping was like $6, $7. Like it was, I know it was less than 10. I know it was less than 10. But if it's one of those things, if you're buying like 15 nail polishes at like the discontinued price on 8 to 8 Beauty is like, what, $2.69? 288 something like that under three dollars for that if you're paying ten dollars in shipping for me honestly it's worth it because i i mean i could i'm getting so much more than i ever would be able to get in the store so it's not like the shipping is making it like a less better of a deal i mean it's making it more expensive but on top of that if i got in the store i still wouldn't be getting as great of a deal so i don't really remember the exact cost of these polishes opi um on trans design but i will put i'll just say what it is right here it'll just be right there so these are 100 percent authentic 100 percent real Transign shipping requires you to put in your credit card information before they tell you the shipping number, but they will tell you how much shipping costs before you have to like finalize your order. So don't be worried or anything like that. I've put my credit card info in before and um, not bought anything just to see how much the shipping was and nothing was charged to my card or anything. You actually have to hit like continue complete order for it to be charged to your card. Because a lot of people get a little worried about like something like that. So next time I've ever seen China Glaze go like be cheaper in stores is um, what it's like on sale at Sally's Beauty Supply. So you can check your local Sally's Beauty and just look in the clearance section. Sometimes they have nail polishes. A lot of the time they don't, but um, my Sally's typically has one or two like strange odd colors. So if you're into that. As for OPI going on sale in stores, most chain places like Walgreens or Target, if they carry your OPI, it's probably never going to go on sale. But if you have like a local non-chain store, like a local business that sells, like a beauty supply store, but it's like specific to your town, those are more likely to go on sale because they're not huge retailers of OPI. The shipping for Trans Design and ATA Beauty, it's not that long, but it's not that short. It takes like, for me, it takes like a solid week, I say, seven days for it to get here at my house, which is, I mean, like, because they say five to seven business days for most things, but um, I don't know, seven days for me, it's fine, but sometimes I, I've had some come earlier, some come later, but um, that's like the average. So my all-time favorite makeup brands is NYX. I absolutely adore, 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 or I, I love, love, love NYX. And I don't have an Ulta near me. Like, literally, there's no Ulta near me. I've never even seen an Ulta. Um, yeah, I've never seen one from the outside, like, driving by like don't know where they are so i saw x sparkage when unboxing video featuring beautyjoint.com and anything that x sparkage puts like but she was like all for it like all behind it like i was like dude you like this like i'm i completely trust her opinion so i ordered the first time there was um a whole bunch of jumbo eye pencils and i love them and they were like less than two dollars each which were amazing than that and then i've also recently gotten all these cream blushes like this is cream gorgeous cream bronzer gorgeous cream blushing eyeshadows pigments they have the most amazing selection ever like literally i'm pretty sure there's every single product that nyx makes on that website i'm pretty sure it's all there and i know most ultas don't have a huge selection of nyx but this has like everything you could ever want from nyx like from eyeshadows to pigments to um lip liners lip glosses lipsticks everything is on this website and it's all discounted so you can also order from this website called Cherry Culture, but not only is Cherry Culture a little more expensive, but when I found the, the customer service with like beautyjoin.com made me be like, I am never ordering from anywhere else. I want to say it took two days shipping. Two days. That's it. That's it. Two days. And I, I, I honestly find that amazing because that's like, that's not even enough time to wish I had the products. It's like, oh, place an order. Like next thing you know, like bam, they're at your front door. Like snap girl. Like I love that. I absolutely love how fast the shipping is and the shipping shipping's not that expensive. I think for me it was like six dollars, five dollars. Like it's not bad at all. Like this is the most amazing thing ever because you get so much NYX and it's such a discounted price. It's basically like if you bought it at IMAX. Like I'm pretty sure the discounted price may even be cheaper than you can buy it at IMAX, which is 20% off. So holler, I was pretty darn stoked.
One of the things I get asked about the most is where to get discounted MAC items. So there's two places that I know have been reputable, but I personally have only been or ordered from one of these things. So the first thing is a CCO, which is a cosmetic company outlet. And I'm going to do have a link down below where you can type in where you live or your city, anything like that, and it'll tell you the closest one to you. So a CCO basically has discounted and discontinued makeup products. Discontinued makeup products are like from um, special collections or holiday collections, anything like that, that they no longer sell at the Mac store or Mac counters anymore. From like Surf Baby, like that will be, that'll, that's gonna be discontinued eventually, and um, uh, like Style Warriors, all that stuff. That's where you can find there. So these products are also discounted about 20, 30%, I think, at a CCO. So CCOs honestly do not have the greatest selection. Um, it varies a lot, a lot, a lot. So if you go to a CCO and you don't really like it, go back in a couple months because they will restock. I've been to amazing CCOs. Las Vegas has an amazing, amazing, amazing CCO, but the one closest to me, it's, it's not that great, but sometimes you can get really amazing stuff. Um, it just really depends on selection because also at a CCO, you can find discounted Estee Lauder, Clinique, and Bobbi Brown, which I absolutely love Bobbi Brown, and I think Bobbi Brown's a pretty expensive makeup brand, so it's nice to like see discounted of that. So the only website I've ever heard of selling legitimate discounted MAC products is allcosmeticswholesale.com. But first off, I have never ordered from this website, so I, from personal experience, cannot put all of me behind it. I don't want to like tell you to go order from there because I've never ordered from there. I don't know if it's 100% legit, but that's why I've heard of other gurus. Megan Hart's makeup's ordered from there, so it makes me think that it is legit, like Arden, um, A Rose 186, all that stuff. So I personally have not ordered from there, but if you have an experience with allcosmeticswholesale.com, please leave in the comments below and thumbs it up so everyone can see that because I don't really have a two cents on it, it's just what I've heard. So all the links to the websites I mentioned and how to find a CCO near you will be linked in the down bar so you can find all of that stuff. Mm, I sound like a horror movie character.